Good. Go ahead. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um. Yeah, I feel very fortunate to have grown up in a town like Farallon. I mean, it's a nice, nice town. It's, it made me feel like. Yeah, it made me feel safe, you know, we didn't have a lot of crime or anything like that. And it was just one of those places where you really could focus on the stuff you want to focus on and not um, not have to worry about the hassles of, you know, like, say, a more dangerous, bigger city or something like that. Or, um, you know, like, when I was young, you know, we were able to you know, play with some of the local kids in town, all the the moms and dads or whatever would keep an eye on you and they'd be able to trust everybody. It was just like, um, my friend uh, Eddie, uh, who passed away from the band Snag, he used to say when he would come out here that it was just total Niceville. Like, people would be like um, raking their yards and waving at you, just like, welcome to the neighborhood, you know, like, that whole kind of thing. And definitely though, like for me, when I started like really getting into metal and me having my metal friends here and stuff like that, it was, um, I'm sure we caused havoc. We were like the ruckus in the neighborhood, you know? And a funny story about my old, uh, the house, um, we, after we played a show in uh, the wetlands in New York, it was Enslaved, Absu, and Incantation was on the tour. And um, after the show, we came back to my house. My mom made a feast for Enslaved and Apsu and Incantation um, at like four in the morning or whatever. She made us like a, a pot roast dinner with like mashed potatoes and I don't know, all the fixing kind of stuff. So there's, there's like these fun memories. And you know, a lot of my old friends like Ross and the Immolation guys, Bob, and um, you know, my, all my bands that I played and stuff like that, they've all been to my house as a kid and stuff. So it was kind of like, you know, it was a cool place. A lot of good memories with, with friends, older, you know, I was a little older friends, but also young, you know, stuff as young kid, it was great. And my parents were basically cool about stuff. Was, like I told you, and the other thing, it was like, just don't be a dick kind of attitude. But my mom loved like cooking and hosting for Enslaved. I mean, it was really funny because, you know, having like Grudel and uh, Ivar and Trim here, you know, and they're, my mom's just asking them like, how you doing? You know, where are you guys from? You know, and you know, oh, you're from Norway. Oh, that's so nice. You know, like my mom would just be, you know, really hospitable and stuff like that, you know? So it was kind of, kind of a trip, you know? My mom 